Hi, my name is Brad Fryan. I'm the production manager at 411. Um, I wear a couple of different hats, but uh, one of my main roles here is um, whenever clients reach out looking for um, a certain type of music, uh, they'll send along a brief maybe with some references and um, it'll be my job to go into our catalog and find a suitable playlist of music that fits their needs. Um, so I build all of our playlists. Um, I also work uh, with composers and artists who are creating new music for our catalog. Um, also do a little bit of a &R as well. Cool, awesome. How long have you been working in the music industry? Um, probably, let me think, since 2016, I think it was. Um, I started first uh, working with uh, music supervisor Maggie Phillips, who um, does uh, shows like uh, Fargo, uh, Legion, The Handmaid's Tale, Snowfall, a whole bunch of others. But uh, she does some great TV shows. And um, uh, I did that for about a year. And then I moved over to 411 um, and have been with 411 for the last five years. Awesome. That's super cool. Um, what do you like most about working in the industry? What do I like most about working? I think it's probably the the different kinds of people that you meet at such a um uh interesting community i think we're all sort of connected by our love of music and um by all of us maybe being a little a little different and weird and um i i think um there are certain commonalities that make it really a, a rewarding community to be a part of what's your favorite music genre tv show or movie Ooh, um, my favorite music genre, honestly, I, I love all kinds of genres, but to see live, I love going to um, like jazz, experimental and free improv shows. I think that is like the most exciting stuff. I really um, love like the interplay between different musicians and hearing um, like the subtleties of how they respond to each other. And I think free, um, free improv is like um, no, uh, genre is kind of a better venue for that kind of music. My favorite movie with regards to music is 2001 A Space Odyssey. Mm -hmm. I think that has the best soundtrack of anything. Um, uh, the, the, um, also Sprach Zarathustra, you know, ba, 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 ba. it's like freaking iconic. I don't think anything, uh, can really top that. Um, that to me is like the gold standard of, uh, of the marriage of, of music and film. On TV, I really loved um, the the revival of Twin Peaks, um, specifically the way that they used music. Um, I thought it was really special in that they, um, more than other shows, they are not afraid of silence. Um, there are a lot of times when you think there would be a music cue, but they just let it be silent and sort of let the audience make up their own mind about what's happening on screen. Mm -hmm. But then because it's so still and silent, whenever they do hit you with the music cue, it has so much impact. Um, so I thought it was really cool to see something that was really judicious with its use of music. And then every time they do use something, it, it was hugely impactful. Um, so that was a cool one. And then last one, what's your favorite meme or viral trend? <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't I don't know if I can really answer that. I'm I'm not on uh, any social media really, and I'm I'm probably a bit more of a luddite than uh, the other members of my generation <laughs> we can say. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, well, at my, at my sister's wedding, we all had to learn how to floss. This was like, this was super in at the time. So my sister taught me what flossing was. So I guess that was a meme at one time. Um, yeah. <laughs> that was fun. Those are all the questions I've got today for the TikTok. Um, thank you so much for answering all of them. I hope they weren't like too basic. Oh, not at all. That was fun. Bye.